Welcome to Demu's Tutorials. Let us prepare four interview questions on engineering materials. Question. What is stress and strain? Answer. Definition of stress. Consider a cylindrical specimen. With cross-sectional area A is under the action of tensile force P. Stress is force per unit cross-sectional area of specimen. And when this specimen is subjected to tensile force, it will elongate in the direction of force. Strain is the ratio of increased portion of the length to original length. Question. What is Hooke's law and Young's modulus? Answer. Hooke's law states that within elastic limits, the stress is directly proportional to strain. Observe that stress-strain curve rises linear within elastic limit. And Young's modulus is the ratio of stress and strain. It is a measure of resistance to being deformed elastically. Unit is Newton per meter square. Question. Define Poisson's ratio. Answer. Poisson's ratio is the ratio of transverse contraction strain to longitudinal extension strain. In the direction of stretching force, tensile deformation is considered positive and compressive deformation is considered negative. Question. What is the difference between yield strength and ultimate tensile strength? Answer. Yield strength is the end point of elastic limit. And ultimate tensile strength is the end point of plastic limit. Question. Differentiate between stiffness and Young's modulus. Answer. Stiffness is a general term which may be applied to materials or structures. When a force is applied to a structure, there is a displacement in the direction of the force. Stiffness is the ratio of the force divided by the displacement. Whereas Young's modulus is ratio of stress to strain. The concept is the same. Except that stress substitutes for force, and strain substitutes for displacement. Question. What is meaning of necking and when does it occur? Answer. After the specimen starts expanding beyond its plastic deformation limit, it starts fracturing. Fracture starts with necking. Question. What is hardness of a material? Explain with an example. Answer. Hardness is very important where moving or revolving parts are in surface contacts with each other. It is the ability of material which makes it resistant to scratch, penetration and wear. Example is cam and follower. Question. Explain the condition where the ductility is required. Answer. Ductility is property of material which allows it to expand plastically. To deform into long objects, like wires. Question. Define malleability with example. Answer. Malleability is a property which makes the material capable enough to deform plastically. And change to thin sheets. Thanks for watching. Log on to dies.biz for more engineering tutorials.